It's running? I don't think it's that big. Uh, I lied, it's big. Already, we just got here. How many fish is that total for you? Probably about 10 today. Nice. Go. Look at that. All right, cool. let's freaking go, man. All right, nice. We're using the same bait. I don't know why I'm not catching anything. I got, I got. got it? I think so. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Let's see what we got. Nice, another butter perch. You got bamboozled. The problem is there's kelp right here, so we gotta check because sometimes they drag it right away. Look at that. All oh, the bait's kind of kept. <laughs> what the heck? I think you doubled up. Nice no, school with him. Or did I? Yeah, you doubled up. Nice. You got a rock rass and it looks like a butter perch. Nice one, Trey. Thanks. My first double. That's crazy. That's so funny. The shrimp just came out of his mouth. He's giving you back your bait. I gotta swim in to get it. All right, thank you, Mr. Rockgrass. Nice lips. Enjoy this guy back. Come on. Well, it would definitely help if I released the bail. <laughs> I do that at least like once a week. I do it more often than I want to admit. <laughs> and then I act like it was intentional after. Oh yeah, just testing out my rod. Getting some nibbles. Garibaldi. Yeah, it's a Garibaldi. Okay, I got it out. I think I see a very, very tiny opal eye, like two inches nibbling at the shrimp right now. This guy is so small, he's not even moving the bobber. <laughs> it's just gonna be gone, you wouldn't even notice if you didn't see it. <laughs> Something's nibbling, that's a good sign. They're trying so hard to take it. There's so many tiny ones right here. Wait. You think so? Nice, looks like another butter perch. Oop, that's a good nibble. You got, ah, oh, yeah, I did. Nice, a little dinky opal eye. Yeah, just like I thought. Look how tiny he is. All right, first fish of the day. A super dinky opal eye, very beautiful. That's a good looking opal eye right there. Nice light blue eyes, look at that. They're not even dark, pretty fish. Down on the tail, some tinges of blue around the edges. Pretty cool fish. All right, let's let you back, little guy. Thanks for playing. What's up, anglers and anglets? It's your boy Sven, and welcome back to my channel. I'm out here with my boy Trey. Hey! And we're gonna do some fishing out at Dana Point. We're just gonna do some chill fishing. Got a bobber set up. We can see a whole bunch of Garibaldi swimming around, a whole bunch of super tiny opal eyes. Some of them not even bigger than like one inch. So that's probably what's been stealing most of our baits right there. But there are a couple of big opal eyes in the mix. That's what we're going for. It's a beautiful day, nice and sunny. There is no breeze. Water is super calm, which is why I'm using the bobber right now. Mullet just jumps. Got one? <laughs> nice. Another dinky opal eye. Well, the bite's pretty hot, so enough duping around. Let's get back to fishing. Right now, I technically do have a high-low rig, except I added the bobber. But before we get started, we gotta talk a little bit about safety. Not the craziest spot I fished before, but as usual, make sure you got shoes with appropriate traction so you don't slip. Water is pretty calm right now, so if you needed to get water for your bucket, you can easily just walk down there. Holy moly. Is it a nice one? Yeah. Oh yeah. Trey on another fish. Let's see what it is. Oh, that's a good one. Is that a spot fin? Spot fin, I think. Yep, spot fin. Nice! A spot fin. Beautiful one. That's a really good one. Oh my god. That's like two pounds. Nice one, Trey. Look at that, guys. Nice spot fin. Huge guy. 1.4. 1.4. That's still a really chunky boy. Pretty good. Not too bad. 
I haven't caught a spot fin in a super long time, so let's change the rig to go for those guys. All right, I'm re-rigged up the high-low rig with two pieces of shrimp. Just gonna throw it out there and see if we can catch a nice spot fin or any croaker, honestly. I think Trey already caught another fish. It's popping right now. Look out, dude. <laughs> Super dinky calico. That's not what we want. I already caught a few dinkers today. Ooh, that's a nice one. Good fish, good fish. Find another croaker, if I had to guess. Another double. No way. Yeah, I think you doubled up again. <laughs> a sargo and a butter perch. That's a really good sargo. Beautiful. It's running? I don't think it's that big. Uh, it's big. Oh, it's a nice one. Already, we just got here. Oh, it's huge. Very nice. Another decent sized spot fin nice for Trey. Dude, I'm not gonna catch any fish, you're just gonna get all of them. There's more out here, Sven. Come on. How many fish is that total for you? Probably about 10 today. Nice. Here, let's take a quick look at the spot fin. Look at that. So they're called spot fins because they have a spot on their fin. That's literally the best way to Whoa. identify them. <laughs> All right, let's freaking go, man. All right, nice. Something's interested now. Come on, it's been like, what, two hours? <laughs> Since I caught a fish? Yeah. Okay, I'm just gonna go ahead and check it. Yeah. Oh, something's still nibbling. Really? Yeah, I feel it. I don't think it's on yet, though. Okay, I'm just gonna check. Oh, yeah, yeah, something's on. Got it? Yeah. It's a dinky butter perch. Oh, it is a butter perch. Woo! Nice, look at this guy. This is the second fish I caught after two hours of nothing. Not even sure what's going on. Trey's caught like at least 10 fish already. Hold on, let me let this guy go first. All right, thanks for playing, Mr. Butter Perch. Oh, he's still here. Sir, the other way. We're using the same bait. I don't know why I'm not catching anything. I got, I got. I think so, yeah, yeah. Let's see what we got. Nice, another butter perch. That's a really good size one. Oh yeah, 100%. Oh. Yeah, I think I'm gonna keep this guy. Finally, a nice, decent fish. Third fish in three hours. That's That's good. Look at that, guys. Very nice butter perch right here. Good eating size. No more bites at the last spot. Trey's heading to the store really quick to go pick up some supplies. So I'm gonna try to catch as much fish as I can before he catches all of them. There are so many squirrels around here though. Look at them go. They better stay away from my cooler. Ooh, nibble. Trying to film some scenery. Get the bell off. Come on, fishy. I got tackled. Not even sure by what. Oh man, it just snapped my rig in half. What the heck? What the actual heck? If I didn't have 10 pound braided, I might have been able to get it. All right, let me just swap rods really quick. All right, getting some nice nibbles along the edge. Yep, that's a good one. Come on, fishy. You getting nibbles too? Trey's on a fish. Of course he is. Good fish. It's a smelt. No way. I think it's a smelt. Take a bite. It went into my line. Did it? Yeah, it did. I don't know how it tangled. It's a clown fiesta right now. He must have swam around in loops. That's a big smelt. Holy cow, Trey, that's a huge smelt. That's a smelt. You know, I've caught a couple 14 inch smelts, but uh, I'm gonna guess this is 16 and a half inches. Jeez, very nice, Trey. Thank you. Straight 16? 16 inches, yep. A straight 16 smelt. Big boy, nice. 